Hey there, welcome to Biz Intelligence. And in this video, we are gonna take a look at how to smartly use Power Query Navigator window in Power Query. So what are we waiting for? Let's get started. Let's import some data from another Excel file. We will go to data tab on the ribbon and we'll click on get data from file from workbook. Now let's select the file that we want to import and it will launch Power Query Navigator window where you can see the list of data sets available in the selected file. These are the few sheets in the selected Excel file and these are a few name ranges available in the Excel file. Now here if you click on this data set, this object, you will be able to see the preview of data inside that data object so here i can select only one item at a time and if you want to select multiple items you will have to go to this option which says select multiple items and check this box and this will allow you to select multiple items by clicking on these check boxes so i can tick to this check box and make multiple selection of the data source and here one thing you can notice that if i click outside this checkbox it will not be get selected that means if click outside this checkbox it will not allow me to select that object so i will have to precisely go inside this checkbox and make the selection so tip number one is you can hold control key and you can click anywhere to make the selection if i hold control key if i click on this object name it will get selected if i click outside this whole object still it will get selected so it is easy and you don't need to precisely go into that checkbox to make selection now if you have selected multiple items and you want to unselect all the selected items there is no option to unselect all so tip number two is unselect all items you can go to this option which says select multiple items and uncheck this checkbox and again check this checkbox and you will see the selected items are unchecked now this is how you can uncheck all the selected items tip number three is select all data sets in one go what we can do is select first item and go to the last item hold shift key and check this box of the last item and it will automatically select all the items in this list so this is how you can select all the data sets in few clicks if you are new on our channel then subscribe us and visit our channel to watch more such videos. Do not forget to like and share this video with your friends. Thank you for watching.